Hi everybody, this is Belle, and this is Belle with Artistic Breeze, and she's our little mascot. This is my little doggy Belle. Look over here, Belle. Say hi to everybody. Why don't we say hi? Hi everybody, I'm Belle. She's the poochie with the poncho. It's pretty chilly out here in Florida right now. Belle, let's look at the camera. Say hi to everybody. Hi. Say hi. Say hi, Belle. Say hi. Okay. Alright, everybody. I am Bree with Artistic Breeze. I'm your host. And most of you know that I recently had emergency heart surgery. So, um, bear with me. I'm trying to get through this. <laughs> I've been doing way too much. And I'm pretty exhausted. Um, a little bit hurting. But I want to get through this for you. So on this video, we're going to go ahead, and Belle, you should look at everybody. We're going to go ahead and show you some happy mail that I've received and some very heartfelt wishes, get well wishes. And um, we also have some winnings, um, some projects that I'm working on, and then we're going to get to the giveaway winners. So bear with us. We're going to get to it right away. So we're going to pan down. And I just wanted to say hi to everybody and just, just really, I put makeup on for you, but I really didn't need to and, and I really didn't feel like it. But I wanted to be presentable for you guys, so um, just a heartfelt thanks from me for all the understanding and love and care and everything that has poured out from you guys to me. I truly truly needed that in my life and I appreciate it so much and I appreciate all you guys and just hugs and love from me to you and let's go ahead and get started with the video excuse my voice it's not quite up to par but we're going to go ahead and pan down and we're going to start with the happy meal so bear with me for just a moment I'm going to get it ready so my friend Jude is so sweet, so I'm going to show you some cards that I got from her, and I'm going to go ahead and show you some of the, and she's always so sweet and sends me the most beautiful cards, and uh, I just adore her. So she is Hey Jude Cards here on Instagram. Uh, look her up on Instagram. I'm sorry, we're not on Instagram, <laughs> we're on YouTube, but like I said. Okay, so this is one she had sent to me for Halloween, and I just, you know, guys have been going through a lot. So it's super cute. It's a shaker, and I just love it, and her coloring is amazing, and she put it on this silver paper, and I'm not going to read them to you guys because they're personal notes to me, and I think they'd want to keep it that way, but super cute shaker card there. And then, um, here's another one she sent me. Look at her beautiful coloring, guys. This woman is so sweet, and she's a good, good friend. And I just adore her, and, you know, just look at all the embellishments, the sentiments with the vellum. She just is amazing, and this is her logo on the back there. So I'm just showing you guys that. Thank you so much, Jude. And she does send me a lot more. So, um, and I forgot the shaker mix, but hopefully I'll, I'll get that out. She sent me the cutest shaker mix. It has little scissors in it. I don't know where she got it, but it's so beautiful. So then, um, we're going to go ahead on to Betsy. And um, I think she calls herself Rebecca or Becca. And Hernandez, and she sent me. I did a wish on Lori's channel, and so she sent me the most beautiful card. Look at this, guys! It's all embellished with glitter, and she gifted me some bales. So I don't want to let you see what's inside that, but I needed some jewelry bales to make some presents for some folks that have really been there for me through some very trying times in the hospital and whatnot and the things I've been going through and and uh, so I'm just paying it forward by doing some 
jewelry pieces for some people that have touched my life in that way. So thank you so much for that and you gifting me that. And I did, um, and then so the next one I'll show you. I did a, um, I granted a wish as well. So I'm going to show you hers. Her name is Jeannie. And look at this adorable, adorable card. It has the thank and you cut out. It's got a doily, a beautiful flower here. The doily goes to the back of the card. And, um, you know, uh, for me going through this, uh, it's been a very trying experience. And, um, just the sweet well wishes that go into these guys. I really, you guys have all touched my heart so much. And I just say thank you for that. Sorry, I'm getting a little emotional, but it's okay. So next up we have Betsy Birch. And she's such a sweetheart. So I wish I could, uh, let me see if I can cover up. I have to cover up the addresses here. I have to, that's upside down, but anyway, she even did the envelope, and it, and a lot of the girls did, and they didn't show you those, but I don't want to show addresses, but you can see that, which carries on to this most beautiful card, look at this, and it's so touching, just the pouring out of love and support that I've had, um, it's just been amazing, and I just, and look at these most beautiful. There's little dew drops on there. There's sparkle. And, and these are like really um, blinged up stickers. And it's get well soon. And thank you so much, Betsy. I thank you so much for that. Let me see. This is her signature back there. And um, just her sending it to me. It just... You know, uh, the, the messages mean so much and the cards and I, I just, I adore you guys for supporting me and I, I try my best to support you all too because I just, you know, I feel like we're a big family. You know, a family of love and support and kindness and, you know, I just really, truly love that. So next up, a really beautiful card from Trisha McFarland and this is her and then Hers is handmade by Trisha on Instagram. And this very beautiful dimensional flowers. The colors are gorgeous. Thinking of you. Get well card. And that's the back of hers if you want to look up her information. And I'm going to try to put some links below to the ladies who sent me such beautiful things. And uh, just sweet well wishes and stuff so I'll try to remember to link as many channels as I can we do have a lot of them and then we have next up is Ursula who is Arctic Glam and a very cute card and let me see me I have it the right way so I have it the right way and she did send me some sequins I believe it's in the bag here or in the envelope and they're so cute so I'm going to try to show you guys oops I'm dropping them all over I knew I was going to do that sorry humbly hands so she's sent such cute and I'm dropping them sorry guys sorry 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 so anyways there's some trees there's some angels our doves, a Santa, an angel, another angel, some trees, there's some smiley faces, more uh, angels, here's one of the smiley faces, and some bells, so thank you so much for that sweetheart, I just love them, the little angels watching over me, thank you so much. And your card is just beautiful, and I just, you know, we we chat and and everything, and I just, yeah, always so supportive, as well as all the other girls, too, but these, you know, cards just mean so much to me, and you guys do such a beautiful job, and I love the colors and the polka dots, and 
Very cute on that one. Thank you so much, sweetheart. And then we have one in, I th did I, this one's a little bit late in showing and I'm sorry for that, guys. But this is from Karen. Let me see if she has it. Yes, she has her, her info on the back. But look at this distress ink background. And this was for Halloween and just the paper layering and it's a very um, dimensional card. You can see the dimension on the side, but look at her coloring. It's just stunning. So that's from Karen's Cards on Instagram. And she's just a sweetheart and just adorable. So please go check out these ladies' channels. So then we have this. Let me um, hide some addresses here real quick. I wanted you to see the box that was decorated by Betsy, who is Unique Paper 15 on Instagram and on um, YouTube as well. So that's Unique Paper 15, all one word, and her name is Betsy Golan, and she's such a sweetheart and a very good friend. So we're going to go ahead so we don't see any addresses. And she put little suitcases and stuff, but I really don't want to show you addresses. So let me turn this to the side. So um, first we have a card. And I have not opened this, guys. Um, let me pull this out. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. Oh, guys. I have to show you. Look how she... Did the inside of this envelope, Betsy? I don't know how you did that, but that is amazing and that's beautiful. Wow, she's such a talented artist. And look at the cute little washi, so cute with the little unicorns. I love this pink, you know, my favorite color is pink. And, um, and she put the little elephants and did the shaker element. So cute. I love this. It's uh, got each little flowers in it, little stars and whatnot. And these cute colored up little elephants. And uh, wow. Thank you so much, sweetheart. So she says you are unforgettable and... And Betsy, you are unforgettable. You've been an amazing friend. Actually, Betsy is the first one I met on Instagram. and She's just a love. And, and I'm not going to show you everything she said to me. Because I haven't had time to read it. But I do want to show you this here. She knows I love Hello Kitty. And look at that Hello Kitty charm. Look at that. I love it. Thank you so much, sweetheart. I love that. It's on a little dimensional tag in there. And it says... Thanks for being a friend. Aww. I love that so much. You can see that little. You can zoom into that. Hopefully it will focus on it. I want you to show you everything that's said. Okay, so that's the card. So I'm going to read that off camera, guys. And I don't want to make this too long for you. But she's just such a love and a sweetheart. So we have this bag. And these are Jolie's Boutique Confetti. And look at all that stuff you get on there. Look at those beautiful roses and the little heart keys. Our arrows. I can't see that. And it's from By EK Success. So, um, yeah, there's little stuff here. And look at all those things. You got your little roses and Florida de Lis and... So beautiful. Thank you, sweetheart. I love that. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. Look, guys. This is a CC Designs die. And I don't have a lot of dies like this. I don't have anything like this. But I, I don't have a lot of dies. But this is so... Thank you so much, sweetheart. What a sweet thing to give. And this will work well with sentiments and all kind of stuff. And I just love it. Thank you so much, sweetheart. And then she's, she sends me buttons, and I love them. And this is Studio Color Code. The last one I got from her was purple. And I love these teals and and greens and and the purple ones she sent me. And they're all different shapes. And, 
and then flowers and stuff like that. But so how cute. Thank you so much. And they're called Color Therapy Buttons by Studio Calico. So thank you so much, sweetie, for that. And we'll get into the rest of the bag right here. She sent me some Distress Stain and Brush Corduroy, which I don't have. And fossilized amber. And I want you guys to see. Oh my goodness. Look at this beautiful washi tape. It's got like, you know, for birthdays and stuff. But it's it's black and white so you can color it and whatnot. That's just gorgeous. Thank you so much. Oh wow. You're such a sweetheart, Beth. And you always put so much thought and decoration and and just kindness and everything you send and just your love and and I just love you so much hon so she sent me some detox tea and, and I have to say you you have to check out Bessie's channels number one she's so adorable so funny and she has a great sense of humor so I will show you some Things that I probably may have got other than the detox tea, but I don't know. So, um, I, I haven't went through it, I promise. But there might be some gag gifts in here, so be prepared for that. Okay, so I love that. And these are the ones she's been getting off Wish, and, and I told her that I really love these, and I do. And, um... I have not got on Wish, or not Wish, but Holler yet. Um, actually, something had happened to my account when I tried, so I think I'm going to retry it. But um, she's the most amazing, and I do mean amazing shopper I have ever seen in my life. If I could hire her as my personal shopper, I so would. She's just awesome, and she's just so sweet, so funny, so caring, so loving, and I just, she's an amazing artist, so I think you put in a code here, um, I've seen her use them, so maybe I'm not doing this right, I think you put in a, a little code, or maybe it comes with a code, but anyways, it opens up and it's a little, um, I don't remember how she did that, maybe they're all supposed to be down, and, um, I'll have to read it. So, or, or look at her videos again. But I believe you're supposed to just be able to open it a certain way. I think it goes back. But anyways, how cute is that? Thank you so much. I love this. You're going to have to tell me, you know, um, how to work this thing. Because I may not be doing that right. So, I don't want to break it. But anyways, thank you so much, sweetheart. And this is some... Solid perfume ring from Oscar de la Renta. Oh my goodness. This is cool. <gasps> wow. Okay, so this looks like uh, maybe the perfume to it. And how do you... It's so beautiful. Thank you, honey. Oh, okay. Oh, my goodness. Mm, it smells so good. Look at that. How cute is that? So if you're just, like, kind of wanting to freshen up during your day, you just pop it up and put a little bit here and there. <laughs> I love this. Thank you so much, sweetheart. It's beautiful. What a thoughtful gift. Thank you so much, Bets. I love it. It's so beautiful. I love flower rings and stuff like that oh that's just so amazing thank you so much you're such a sweetheart okay so let's see what's in the big bag now she knows I'm a Hello Kitty nut so look what she gave me a Hello Kitty oh my goodness thank you so much so let's, let's take this out of the bag so I'm not sure if there's anything gaggy in here, but there might be. And I love her sense of humor as well as her personality. And like I said, you guys have to, have to, have to go see these ladies' channels. So she gave me some beads because she knows I'm doing the, um, the charms for the 
Traveler's Notebooks, and I'm gonna start making charms for keychains. So look for those guys, and I'll I'll do a tutorial when I'm feeling better on that. I love these, thank you. And look at the pinks and the 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 dark color. I love those. Thank you so much, sweetheart. And that's a lot of beads. Oh my Hello Kitty. Look at that. I love it. It's a little wooden Hello Kitty. Love it, love it, love it. Okay, so let's see. Oh, I love this bag. Wow. Look at that bag. It's gold and and it says thankful and she's got a little little chick clip on there. How cute. So let's see what's in here. I'm trying not to make this too long for you guys. Okay. Let's see what we have in here. Um, okay, so, oh, oh, my, I'm gonna have a heart attack here, guys. Okay, Betsy and I talk a lot, and she knows that I love Pooh Bear, and look what she got me. I have never, I didn't even see stamps for Pooh Bear, and it's Pooh Bear and Tigger and a little... A little log. Look at it. It's so beautiful. Thank you so much, sweetheart. <laughs> Making me cry here. I'm sorry, honey. Thank you so much. It's tears of joy for her to think of me that much. I just love you, girlfriend. And she sent me these beautiful, beautiful um, star tags. So I'm just so shaking up right now. That's so sweet of her and these are so cute and look you can make a, a little banner out of them make somebody's name oh that's so adorable thank you sweetheart I just oh my gosh she sent me some um some ephemera ephemera of Pooh Bear before and and I can just tell you growing up it was my favorite and I just love it so then she was doing an actual Sorry guys, I'm getting choked up, but um, she was doing a, a recipe thing where if she sends you a recipe card and you send her one back, she'll send you a recipe. So I know she's a good cook and I've heard her talk about, you know, some different dishes that she makes. So I'm so looking forward to giving her a recipe and getting one back. So this is the little recipe card. So thank you. I'm so excited to give you one. All right. Oh, here's one of the, I, I knew she'd probably put one in here of something of a gag gift, gift, but it's, it's called More Fresh Less S.O.S. Down There Wipes. <laughs> She's just, I just love her. You are so cute. Okay, now what is this? Uh, Jean Pierre Cosmetics. And I don't know what that is. Looks oily. Maybe it's a a perfume. I don't know. You're gonna have to tell me, sweetheart, what this does. Is that something you put on your lips and wear, or is that? I don't. I I'm not sure. Okay. <laughs> so we'll move on. Um. Oh, these are little foam squares. Look at these. I love those. Always can use more foam squares. Oh, look at it. She sent me more. I love them. Thank you. Okay. I don't want to make this too long. And oh my gosh, guys. These are those uh, tattered angel things you can color up. And there's presents and all kind of stuff in here. And wow, thank you. I love little things like this. When you're in bed and not feeling well, these are the perfect thing to go and do. Just sit down and mindlessly color. <laughs> so I'm gonna start going faster. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. I looked at this just the other day, had it in my cart, did not pull the trigger. I don't know why, but I'm in love with these. Oh my god, thank you so much. 
This one says love, the little hedgehogs. Oh, look at that. And that's a penny black stamp set. Thank you so very much, sweetheart. I just adore and love you. You're so sweet to me, and not for what you give me, for just who you are. Oh, wow. I love this pink box. Oh, my goodness. It's a box you could put together. Look how cute that is. I love this. You got to tell me where you got these. You probably got them from Holler. But I love it. Thank you so much. And a ruler. You can never... I, I'm always re losing my rulers. So, thank you so much, sweetheart. And let's look into this little one. I might need to grab my scissors. Hold on, guys. Okay. Guys, we're going down to... Uh, we might need to change the battery. So... Um, I'm going to try to get the, oh, she made me a chunky charm, guys. Oh, my word. Oh, my word, my word, my word. Oh, oh, I am in love. Look at her chunky charm. She has little stars. Oh, my goodness. Look at this. Oh, the tree of life. She has little crowns oh little shoes look at this this is fantastic i am in love this is going on in my car in my car right away oh my goodness look at all the beautiful beads the lucky clover the the oh my gosh there's a hello kitty with purple Oh, Betsy, thank you so much. And a little sailboat. I have to really look through this. Oh, my God. Oh, and a mushroom for her mom. Oh, my gosh, girlfriend. I love you so much. That's so sweet. A pair of scissors. A shoe. And, oh, my gosh. I just love you so much, girl. Look at the little uh, pumpkin carriage. Gosh, she did such beautiful work here, guys. I love it so much. All of it. So, Betsy and everybody else that sent me stuff, thank you so much. And I, this is going straight in my car and it's hanging from my rearview mirror. I know you're not supposed to do that, but I'm doing it. I love it. Thank you so much. It's on one of those um, Tim Holtz little class thing so I can actually hang it or put it on a keychain or something but that's definitely going in my car for good luck and just for love and remembrance of you so we're going to go ahead and change out the battery and we'll come right back because we're going to get to the giveaway video and I just thank everybody that that has sent me out such love and support and messages and We'll be right back. So give us a few minutes and we'll, we'll be right back to you. And thank you so much, Betsy. I love everything. And I'm going to read your card off camera because I know it's going to make me ball my eyes out. So you guys might hear my voice change a little bit more. But thank you guys so much. And we'll be right back. For you to be a second, for us it'll be a minute or two. So wait for us. We'll be right back. Hi, everybody. Bree here with Artistic Breeze. And I just want to come to you and apologize. Uh, I have not been feeling well. I just had um, emergency heart surgery. And you guys know that I'm coming up on having back surgery. That'll start um, sometime in the first of the year. So um, bear with me. We are going to be starting to do tests at Tuesdays. Um, that's where I will test products like pencils or different art materials and um, we're going to be doing some coloring pages with you guys doing some art materials so we'll have some questions for you for that but let me go ahead and just say sorry the other day's video I had to cut it off memory issue on my camera and we're going to go ahead and start right back up and we're going to do the giveaway so I'm not telling you where exactly we're going to put it in so please watch the, the entirety of the video and we'll have all the news that's coming up for you guys and everything that we are going to be doing. And we will be putting out a schedule soon, but you're going to have to bear with the surgery part of it. And I thank you guys for being patient. I love you all. So, you know, please don't unsubscribe and think that I'm not putting out videos. It's just that, you know, sometimes life gets in the way. So 
let's get started with um, some happy mail, some cards that I've received. So here we go. My dear friend Jude and Spiffy Pitts drew this little chihuahua for me. And you guys all know Belle. And uh, it's just a little beautiful image. She has it co colored up so pretty. And this textured wood grain background is so beautiful. And it's just so sweet that they did this. And go check out both channels. Hey Jude Cards and Spiffy Pets um, is the one that does the drawing. So go look them up too. And thank you so much guys. I love, love, love it. This is Little Bell Bell and... They also uh, do charity drives for pitbull rescues and animal rescues. So go ahead and check out her um, Etsy store, which is Hey Jude Cards on there as well. And uh, I'll try to link everything below. So if I miss something, I'm sorry about that. Still going through a lot. But um, we're trying to get this to you. So thank you, Jude, so much. I love it, love it, love it. So cute. And she also sent me this other beautiful card. And look how she cut out the flowers with the stitching and put all of this and it's like a pearlized paper and it's just so beautiful and she put the believe up there and thank you so much sweetheart for thinking of me I always make such beautiful cards and <coughs> sorry guys had a sneeze ouch um and she's just a love and she's just a wonderful person go so give them some love on youtube or Instagram, I mean. I'm sorry about that. Instagram. And uh, then we have next up, we have a beautiful card here from my friend Francine. And she made me the cutest little animals. Uh, the little deer. Um, these ones are the mama elephant deer with the dyes. And she made these little uh, string of lights. How beautiful. Beautiful. Thank you so much, Francine. I love it so, so much. And thank you all for your support and love while I'm going through this hard time in my life. I truly appreciate all of your prayers and all of your love. And, you know, I just feel so blessed to have you all in my life. I just want to say thank you so much. So thank you so much for that. And then we have next up, Sue Ann Thompson. Yes. Thompson. I always say Thompson, but um, she sent me this most gorgeous, gorgeous card. Oh my gosh. The dimension on this, guys. If you could see this beautiful card in person, and she made this be beautiful paper on the background, and this poinsettia with some, like, burlap paper and snowflakes, and it's just simply gorgeous. Absolutely. And she sent me this really cute die of a butterfly. So thank you so much, sweetheart. I love it. And I love your guys' message. Messages to me. You're uplifting me and making me feel so good. So thank you so much, sweetheart. I truly appreciate that. We really do. And then next up we have Amanda Tuarte. And look at this, guys. We all live in Florida. Amanda and a couple of, of other girls in our Florida Gals group, and she made, like, real sand on here, and made these beautiful die cuts, and this colored up Santa with a snowboard, and look at the background, how she got the waves, gorgeous, and I do mean gorgeous card, guys, thank you so much, Amanda, and just thank you for the support and love you give me, and I appreciate you so, so much, and, uh, Beautiful cards, guys. So thank you for that. So now we're going to get into um, the cards that I've been making. And I'm a little bit late. As you can tell, I've had some bad days. But we're going to... Oops. Drop my table here. We're going to run through them pretty quick. And I'll just show you what I've made here. And, and some of them have went out already. But we'll show you the mainstays that, that have not gone out. So this is a little die cut window. I'm using the MFT shaker bits. So if you can see that, those are those little shaker windows and then the stag head and then I just put some jewels and some paper behind and some glitter paper from Stampin' Up! And these are from Michaels. This was, um, I don't remember. 
So anyways, yeah, that's this card and you can see it's shake. So I went with the gold tones and you have the sag heads in the background. So I'll show you guys that up close. You can see it shake. And then I kind of did that same motif here, but different colors. And I also wrote Happy Holidays back here. And you can see those shake and I did my own handwriting and some glitter. And then the Stampin' Up! glitter around the MFT Square Shaker. The same stag head and just did it with a black card base. And then also I have, have a gold uh, piece of paper covering up the, um, the shaker. And also a Seasons Greetings. I don't know if you can see that. I embossed that with some, I think it was some WOW embossing powder. I'm not sure. But anyways, it's really gold and super sparkly, and that's the other shaker. And then I made this really beautiful, I I was gifted two dies, and I don't know um, what companies these were, because they came in um, the little pouches and everything for me. So anyways, um, I did a bow up here and I cut this out and used slow foam and the silver backing paper there and it is a shaker and I used a paper that was silver with little dotted lines and um, I also used some Lucy cards and I'll bring it real close to you so you can see the bling on here. You can see it here, here and on the card itself I don't even you can see it there and there. And it's super sparkly in person, guys. And the background here and the glitter paper, I alcohol inked. So I used some of the Tim Holtz alcohol inks on a uh, Yupo glossy card paper. And I also inked the glitter paper with it and uh, matched the tones that were in the jewels in there. So you, can you see that shake? And hopefully you can see those beautiful jewels. Maybe come more under the light if you can. Maybe you can see those beautiful jewels from Lucy's cards. They're just gorgeous. So this was just some uh, black paper that I did some fine tech watercoloring on. So that's some... Uh, no, 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 no. Yes, it was fine tech. I'm sorry. And I also used some Brewery's Glitter Ink in the um, wash with that. And so... Um, this one's not signed on the back yet. But I will show you the black ones that are signed. I always put my little charms on them. And I'll show you on some other ones. But that's how it's signed. And that's my Instagram and YouTube channel there. And so um, that's how those go. <clears throat> and here's another one signed with a blue um, or a pink metallic Posca pen is what I used on that and you can see the little um, handmade with love. So I made this super duper sweet card. This is a CC De Designs little girl and a little light bulb card so I made it like the bubbles coming out like she's just floating around and uh, I used I can't remember what paper stack but I'll go ahead and link those below. So I just colored her up put some little bling glitter on it um, here and there, and I used uh, my Copics on that and the rest of her. And then this is just some, um, I don't know if you can tell it, but that's some very shiny metallic paper that I got from Michaels. So there's that one. And then here's another, the other die that I got. And uh, I was gifted this, so thank you so much. To my friend who gave it to this to me and um, it has a little base and it's a little snow globe so I put that backing paper the same paper that I used on the, the other card and just put all the shaker bits in there and went around it so I really love how this came out and then on the inside this was part of a paper line and um, yeah this one signed on the back with my little logo there and I'll go ahead and show you the card really close up so you can see all the sparkle and glitter and little bobbles I used in there. And I did some use some Lucy Jewels, some mixes that I had, some Crafting Desert Diva mixes and some other sequins and some Queen and Company 
embellishments, little bobble balls in there. So that one came out super cute. And we're going to get into some other ones. So this is one I made. So um, I'm not real I don't remember who makes this, but I used the paper line. A friend gifted me a set of stamps, and this little tree die came many, many years ago. And uh, I don't remember exactly who gifted that. It was so long ago. So I used some Stampin' Up! glitter paper here and here. I also used some stickles just to kind of accent a little bit more of the gold tones, if you could see that. So I'll give you a close up, just kind of moving it around. You can see the stickles and the little accents. All right, so there's that one. And then we'll go on to this one. This is a Magnolia image that I colored up. And I put some of the Stampin' Up! glitter paper down here. And I used, um, I think it was a Lawn Fawn dye. A hillside board. I, I don't remember which one this is, but it's a slopey hill dye. And then I took this mirrored paper, and what I did is I s took a tool and just a pokey tool and scratched in where she would be skating. Put her on like a little strip there to look like a bench. And it has this little pretty little um, flowers on it to look like the back of the bench. And I used this from Doodlebug's paper. And I inked the edges all around and uh, colored her with my Copics. Let's see, this one's not done. And then I signed it with the pink Posca metallic pens on the back there. So that one will get a little hard as well. So I'll just show you again. I thought this card came out super duper cute. I hope you love it as much as I do. And these are the Lucy, Lucy's cards, little pearls right here that I used on there to accent that. So there's that one. And then we have this little CC Designs girl again and I used some pencils on this which I will be doing a test at Tuesday on these pencils. And then I used a Marby snow marker to put the snow in there. I don't know if you guys can see that. And then I had these little gems to look like the bubbles coming out of her car. And these I've had for probably about a year. And they're just little lights. So what I did is strung them on this um, twain. And just put some little bows on the side. And glued added them down so they wouldn't move too much. But I just love the bling and the dimension on this card. And I used that, that mirror blue paper on the sides here. I had some left. And this is a Doodlebug paper pack that I used in the background. So there's that one and we'll show you up close. You can see the full dimension and that one was signed with a blue uh, metallic Posca pen. So there's that one. And then you guys remember this um, card. I am sending it out but I never showed it on YouTube but um, this is the Santa shaker I made. We did a Christmas in July I believe. Block hop, and then I used a sticker from a paper line and some sequins to go around. Colored the Santa up, used some ranger stickles on here, and I gave Santa some rosy cheeks, and then I cut it out for the shaker. Then you open this up, and on the inside you have a little pocket right here. So this little tag has a little Magnolia Girl, and there's some of those more Lucy's gems on there. I tied it with some twine, some different color twine. <coughs> Sorry. Mm. And, uh, you know, just wanted to stick a little tag down here that kind of matched the paper line. And um, then you have a little tag in there, and it says the round man is coming to town. So I thought that was very befitting for this card. So that's going to somebody very special. Also signed by me. And the last two are certainly not the least. Um, I used this little Stamping Bella image which I got on a sale and I'm so happy. 
This is, I believe, a die cuts with a view, a DCW V pack. It's a glitz and glam, I think it's called. So I layered the silver paper over this dot paper, colored her with my Copics and the tree and everything else, put some um, Brie Reese glitter inks and whatnot um, for the accents, and then put some glossy accents over the shoes. And, oh, actually, no, this is my Spectrum Noir glitter paint. I'm sorry about that. <laughs> and then I used that Marby Snow text on there to make the little snow. So I thought she just come out adorable. I just love her. And a glossy accent in her shoes, the little table here, and the star on top. So I think this one came out super duper cute. I hope you guys like it. And the last but very not least is my fave. I use these Crafton Desert Diva little um, reindeer. And they're kind of on the paper stack that I was using. And this is some of the Stampin' Up! Hillside dies that I used on that. And you can see that on the other card. So if anybody... I'll remember to tag who made these. And then uh, this background paper just was so beautiful. So I colored them up with my Copics, I fussy cut them out, and then I took black paper and fussy cut them out again. And then I used the little uh, ranger stickles on the snowflakes that the little one's licking. And I think this is such a playful card because it looks like this guy's like he's ready to play with his brother. And his little brother's just like, well, I'm just going to get some snowflakes on my tongue. <laughs> So I just love how this one came out. I hope you can see the sheer sparkliness and that beautiful pattern in the background. I super love this card and I love these Craft and Desert Diva guys. So, so stinking cute. Okay, now we're getting on to some projects that I've shown on Instagram, but I haven't shown you guys here. So this is one of the Prima Princesses that I've colored recently. I used my Copic markers for her, and um, I haven't done the background and or the little spots yet, but I'll get to that. I just wanted to show some projects that I've been working on and finishing. Also as well, this is the other Prima Princess, and I have a one more, but I, I wasn't able to find her right away. Kind of doing a revamp, but everything's at a halt because of the surgeries and stuff, so bear with me. So I did this with my Copics as well, and I just love these little Premium Princess stamps. They're quite big if you look at my hand, but um, they are so fun to just, you know, when I don't want to draw and I'm not feeling well, I just get in, you know, a mode and color. So I colored with her with my Copics as well, and I'll do something with the background soon, but just haven't had the time. And this is a Donna Danny, Downey stamp. And this is all watercolored, just layers and layers of watercolor. So um, I just wanted to come on and show you that I did the background and um, everything else. And I think I might do a little bit more with her hair. Not sure yet, but did her. And now let's get into the coloring pages. Well, actually, what should we do? Let's do the coloring pages in this fun time, right? Sounds good. Okay, so this is the little um, My Besties coloring book. I transferred her onto Spectrum Noir paper. I also did a video with this. It was a speed through, and I used all the new uh, crap. Uh, sorry, <laughs> Crafters Companion um, products that I got, and and I used pencils and their markers. And their paper takes a, a, a huge amount of ink. I am so impressed with this paper. I even did some watercoloring with Fine Tech watercolors on it. And the bleed through, I layered and layered and layered on this paper. And not much, guys. And so, um, on the Test It Tuesdays, we'll be doing some color pages and stuff like that. And other days. And, um... Hopefully you guys like the longer videos because I think I'm going to do some in real time. 
So if you want to let me know what you think about that, that's fine. I'd love to hear from you. If you guys like the longer videos or some speed through and longer. So these take, you know, quite a long time. So we might do them in one part or two parts. <coughs> Excuse me, depending on the image. So I just want to show you some things that I'm working on. Some works in progress. And this one is a Jasmine Beckett. Oh my gosh, I am in love with this gal's images. And her paper is a lot thicker than than the uh, paper that comes in like the other. You can see how thick the ones are. So this is a thicker paper. I used some markers and then I went over it with my Prismacolor markers and um, just kind of heightened some of the areas. And I think it came out pretty cool. So we're, doing, we're going to be doing some of her coloring pages. And this is another, and I thought it was so befitting to do a My Besties Christmas image. So on here I use a, a tiny bit of marker. And these were Cali Art markers. So we're going to do some of the, the reviews on some of the products that I'm getting new products to me possibly new products to you and I used some paint for the background and like I said I, I did some marker work and then uh, over it I used some pencils so we'll be looking at those pencils um, soon and I think she came out super duper cute and I used some um, Nouveau drops to do the glitter around there so love how that came out this is a work in progress, guys. And I did use some Cali Art markers on this. Also, um, I used some pencil over it on this area. So she's totally not done. But just to start to her, I need to do some more blending with pencils around her. Do a background. So this is also in the My Besties category out of her books. Also, another of my besties that I started to do, and I haven't finished her yet. And this is using the Spectrum Noir um, Color Blends pencils, and I am in love with them. I, they do a very good job, and so I wanted to see, show you that work in progress. And we have also this work in progress, which is a My Besties image as well. So this one is just straight um, pencils. So I used the, some of the Spectrum Noir ones on here that I got from Craft and Desert Divas. And I also used some DeWent Color Soft or Pro Soft. I think they're called Color Soft. And uh, I'll link everything below the products I used. Um, but yeah, she's a started piece and we'll get her done. And once the background's around it, this won't look so stark. So there's the projects. Now, we get to the super fun time, guys, and right after that, I have some news that we'll be doing. So, we have all the names in here that is on Instagram and YouTube who entered the giveaway, and thank you guys so much for supporting this. So, JJ, you get to pick, and you have to close your eyes, so I need the camera. Okay. So, hold on, guys. I'm not going to make you dizzy. Okay, JJ, you got to... Let's Hello, see. I promise. I got my eyes okay. closed. Eyes closed. Oh, you're not in it. <laughs> okay, he's getting in there. Pick one name. You got one? Yes. Alright, let's open that name and see who won, guys. Oh my goodness. And wouldn't you know, oh my goodness. And the winner is... Hey Jude Cards, Jude. can you see that? I'm gonna hold it up. You take it. Let's not make him dizzy. Hello, oh my Jude. gosh. Hey Jude Cards won. All right, hey Jude. Give congratulations. Me, congratulations. I'm so happy you won. And just so you guys know, I love you all. And I would have been happy for everybody to win, but it's Hey Jude Cards. And I'll show you that there's other names in here. Just so you don't think we you know, picked out a name. Um, there is For the Love of Crafts there. There's also 
um, Julie Krabnoff. There it is. So you can tell we we would put you all in there. Rosalie Howington. So yay, hey dude cards. Thank you so much. I'll, yeah, I'll go thank ahead. You girls. We appreciate yes, it. thank you for supporting my giveaway. And I'll go ahead and contact you on Instagram and let you know you won. And uh, congrats. Yay. So the prize pack she will be getting. And we showed you in that. And you can watch the other video. Um, is quite large. And we put a lot of products in it. But also, too, she will be getting the. Uh, I'm going to be making a personalized project for her that you guys get to see at the end. It's going to be personalized to her colors, what she wants, and what she wants with it. So um, we'll come back and show that. And I'm so happy. Congrats again uh, to Hey Jude Cards. And um, also, thank you guys so, so much. And I wanted to also show you... Look at this beautiful sticker that um, Sue Ann put on the back of this. I love it. It's like origami, but it's all shiny and sparkly. But, guys, I just want to say the news is that you all know I'm getting ready to have another surgery. But we are going to stick to a test at Tuesdays after everything's all over. We're going to start doing some for ahead of time so you guys have something to watch. And then we also are working out another day that works for us for postings. And we'll let you guys kind of choose and go on to what you want um, for some videos and such like that. We're going to be doing some coloring pages. You guys can weigh in and on your opinion on that. <clears throat> Sorry for my voice. It's going out now. But anyways, I just love you all. Hugs and love from me to you. I just adore you all. You know... It's going on this artistic journey with all of you means a lot to me. It means just so much to have your love and support and your interaction and your friendship. And as well as I love going on your journeys and supporting all of you. And I just want to say please bear with us. And we will be bringing some content to you. I'm not supposed to be doing as much as I've done. So there, there's been some lapses there. But... You know, I wanted to get some cards out for Christmas and just, you know, spread the love. And you guys, let's be kind and love one another. Let's spread all the love we have during the holidays and throughout the year. And I hope you have the best year ever. And I love you all. And I can't wait to meet new friends and more friends. And let's all be a community of friends. We're making a Facebook page. We also have a blog that we're getting up and running. So that's artisticbreeze.com. So all the social media sites will be linked soon. And uh, hopefully we can have a nice community on, on Facebook. We're going to do some live shows pretty soon when we can. And uh, anything that you guys would like to see, let us know. And again, Merry Christmas and Happy New Year. Be safe out there. And again, we love you all. And thank you so much for watching us and supporting us. And we will see you soon. If you haven't subscribed, subscribe because we've got some really wonderful content coming out to you guys. Some products that maybe um, that I bought myself that I want to really get out there to you guys. They're new uh, products to a lot of people. So I really want to demonstrate them to you. So that's going to be Tested Tuesdays. And then we're going to come up with some coloring pages in all different kind of mediums. So... Again, have a blessed holiday. We love you all. Hugs, loves, and kisses. And we will talk to you soon. Bye for now. Congratulations again, June. Yes, congrats. I'm so happy you won. And thank you all for entering. And congratulations. And we'll talk to you soon. Bye. Loves and hugs.